I'm Peter Steinle. I'm one of the journeyman printers here at the printing office at Colonial Williamsburg. Today I'll be showing you how to mix a varnish with lamplac to make an ink for the printing office. Flax is grown in Virginia for fabric production, but flax can also be grown to produce seeds. These tiny little seeds in their zillions produces linseed oil. And that's one of the components that we have used here to make a, a varnish. This is just a straight linseed oil. It doesn't really have any tackiness. Great for paints. Problem is it tends to dry very slowly. So we need something that's a little stickier. This is about half pine rosin. Pine rosin is a solid pine sap. This has been boiled with the linseed oil and that linseed oil and pine rosin makes for a sticky base that we can put pigments in. Not particularly happy with this particular varnish that I made uh, outside of town. And it could be a little stickier. Let me show you a varnish that is essentially the same as what I have there, but the difference is it was set on fire. That with pigment in it would probably be a little bit too strong for us. We want it to stick to the paper. We don't want it to shred the paper. So I'll add a little bit of this older varnish. This was made with a slightly different resin. And this stuff is years old, but uh, it should, when added to this newer varnish, stiffen it up. So I'm using the brayer to mix. And as I get this varnish well mixed, we're just going to add the, the lamp black to it. The lamp black is very fine powder. We'll start off with a, a small amount from this piece of wood. Let me show you what we have thus far. And it has an, a, a fairly nice tackiness to it, not so strong that it's likely to shred the paper. We're gonna take this ink over to the ink block at the press and we'll use it today with what we're printing.